for the wait. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Looks like you uh, were having trouble hanging on there at the end. Yeah, I mean, it was, at the end of the day, it was a training run. My coach said, let's go back to that Chanel that goes out hard and, and, and sees, see, let's see what your body does, you know, and um, 40 meters out, I'm like, okay, <laughs> we're seeing what my body's doing, you know, but if you're going to beat someone like Brenda, you know, or those really strong women, you're going to have to take them out hard, and that's what, that's what it's going to come down to, down to in Sacramento, Sacramento, so um, I think she's leaning towards the eight, just talking to her in the Bahamas, and so I'm like, all right, well, if I want to beat you, I'm going to have to take you out hard, so, like, again, it was just training, seeing how it went, and hey, I got the win, so. <laughs> now, what do you think of that 700? Um, I was feeling good. I saw 128, I saw 143, and uh, I think I got a little bit too antsy. Um, my coach always says, don't race for time. When you run well, it'll come. So I should have listened. Um, I, I think I just punched a little bit too much coming down the straightaway, and I definitely felt it. But it, either win, you win or you learn, and I won, but I also learned a lot from that race. So. Were you afraid you might not win at that point? At 40 meters out, I was like, I know they're coming, but just hold your form, hold your form, hold your form, and it, I was happy to get to the finish line. <laughs> when you talk about tra being a training run. Do you come in here thinking win too, or is that when yeah, you talk about I a mean, training run? Yeah, I mean, yeah, you always want the win. I knew, I knew I was in shape to go uh, under two. I mean, I, I did it in Doha, uh, just a different way. I think we were 59 high, and then came back really, really strong. So just practicing different techniques because. But again, in the rounds, you're going to want to go 59, but that last round, I'm, you want to go, you know? So just got to practice different ways, so, yeah. Do you see Maggie and them coming up on you at the end? Uh, no, I, I need to become more aware. I heard the announcers, I heard the fans, so I, and, and I knew I was slowing down, so I knew they would be coming. But um, like I said, I just tried to keep my form and get to the line, so, yeah. What's next for you? I'm actually going to just shut it down until USA's. Uh, May has been a little hectic for me yeah, with Doha and busy. Bahamas in here. And so I just want to get some solid training in these next few weeks and try to get that win out in Sacramento. So, How's life and or training been since Bahamas? Uh, it's been awesome. It's been a whirlwind since uh, Indoor Worlds. I mean, my life yeah. changed. Uh, no more working. So, <laughs> um, and just... Just training hard, and um, but like I said, this May has been pretty hectic, and so I'm ready to just get back to the drawing board and get some good training in. Yeah. 2014's been a, a banner year. I mean, is, is a sky limit at this point? Oh yeah, it is. Um, I said earlier this year that I want to consistently just get, try to get as close to two or under two as possible. That's what I want to use this year as just you know get just keep just keep getting under it at least two minutes, and so. Um, that's the goal, and, and I would love to win my first title. Uh, I've never won a U.S. title, even indoor. I won Worlds, but I didn't. <laughs> Ajay got me at USA, so it's just it would it would be awesome to win a title. And you, then. You, you wouldn't trade that. No, no, no. <laughs> I learned a lot from Ajay getting me at the line at, at, out in uh, Albuquerque. So. All right, thanks for that. Thank you. To, uh, be out here in Eugene. And the way feel today. Oh, it was good. I mean, it, I'm a little tired. From May has been hectic, like I said, so I'm a little tired. Um, came from the Bahamas, had one day at home and came out here. So it's just a lot going on. And so I'm glad I got the win, but I'm happy to get home and just get some good training in. How many times did you rest here before? <sighs> Since, I mean, I was telling them I ran here as a 17 year old in the mm -hmm. Prefontaine Classic against Maria awesome. Matola. Yeah, and uh, I think she was going for her 16th win. Mm -hmm. Yeah, her sweet 16. And I was just a baby. I probably hit those same exact splits at 17. You know, Jeez. I would just, I've always just gone, you know. That, that, and so um, it was good to actually win this time. <laughs> but I've run here countless times. I love it. The fan, the fans are awesome. They carried me to that win, definitely. <laughs> cool. Thank you so much. Thank you.